to the vlog. I look like somebody just beat me up. It me. I was, no, it's called, I was just wearing an N95 mask. Oh. And I'm having an allergy day from the dusty Christmas decorations. Yeah. People, if you, um, it does have a sign, I think. My I told you and you wouldn't believe me. I believe you now. <laughs> after the fact. If you have access to N95 masks, now is the time to use them. It's the surge. Yeah. It's the surge and people are still stupider oh, than ever. Oh, today was bad. There were people walking around, noses uncovered and their entire face uncovered. And most of them were elderly. Yeah. I mean, some of them had the masks on, but then when they got up to the checkout counter, they pulled them down. Why do you do that? That's the worst time to pull them down. I don't know, but it was rough in there. But there was young people as well. Yeah, but it was mostly the older people. And they're more vulnerable, so I, don't, I just don't get it. I don't get it. I mean, I know it's hard to breathe through the mask, but it's even harder through a ventilator. In, in New York, Cuomo, the governor, was saying that um, hospitals should be planning now to recruit retired doctors and nurses yeah because they expect it to be so bad yeah you know we're just about a month now from uh thanksgiving and i, I mean a week so yeah you know in the next week i think you're going to see even bigger spikes and forget about christmas that's going to be even worse well we don't know <laughs> if everybody got sick from thanksgiving maybe maybe it won't happen at christmas i don't i don't know I think people are more likely to get together for Christmas than they are for Thanksgiving. Yeah, but it's a bigger holiday. You have the you know virus there, so maybe yeah. maybe it will affect the pen. I don't know, but they're supposed to be rolling out the vaccinations for New York like next week, I yeah, think. Yeah, for first responders. Yeah. So that'll be very, very interesting. But yes. we just went to ShopRite and now we're heading over to the restore. Um, to see if they have anything. Uh, I know. <laughs> we, we're probably going to end up having to wait online really? to get it. Well, they don't open till 2 and it's now 1.20. I think people are lying at the end of the um, I don't want to have to wait online. You can hold my spot while I wait. <laughs> he would never make me do that. Never. You're just such a jokester, aren't you? Yes, you are. Hello. <laughs> um, we went to the restore and we got there half an hour early and we had to sit in the car and then we had to be the ugly people who got out and waited first by the door like uh, Bowie trying to get in the door on the porch <laughs> in the why snow. Did, why you gotta be ugly though? Because I didn't want to have to wait sitting there and then wait again to go in because they only let a certain amount of people in. Uh -huh. And guess who pulled up next to us? Who? The tiniest chihuahua in the world. Oh. Was not driving. <laughs> and his owners were eating these giant freaking hoagies. Oh yeah? Yeah. And the, you were jealous? I was. And the Chi Chi was sitting on the guy's lap like this. Oh. Feed me. Feed me, father. Squid Am I right? Yeah. Sean, how does Squid Father go? <laughs> yeah, Squid Father is a villain. So I was really pissed off too hey, because at ShopRite these were 99 cents each, I think. And I, cents each or pound? Pound. And I thought, wow, that's a really good deal. <laughs> and then we went to um, Hannaford's and they had these for 47 cents. They also had these for 47. <laughs> Actually, those might have been like 88 cents a pound, I'm not sure. But these were 99, the red peppers, that was a really good deal. I didn't know you were hiding rye bread in there. Yeah, <laughs> we got that the other day. But we also got this pumpernickel. We never saw. That we never saw pumpernickel by them. Yeah. And it's really good. Yeah. I like it. And I got more Miyoko's because now I really, really like this. At first I wasn't sure. But now it just, it tastes buttery. Like, you know how butter has like those butter. foamy things to it? No. The foamy component of butter that they make ghee out of? It, that reminds me of ghee. 
more than like a margarine. Margarine doesn't remind me of ghee at all. <laughs> so I guess we're gonna have something to eat and then I gotta yes, get busy. Hungry. I gotta get busy. Gotta start moving some stuff around. It's Janet's moving company. Oh boy. Ugly out there, and I gotta go out there. They didn't have it. Did I mention they didn't have anything good at the restore? We did look at like this baking cabinet that was kind of interesting. It's a baking cabinet. It has like special drawers and doors that you put like your flour and sugar and like. Oh. Some of the drawers were like curved, mm -hmm. so like you could put a scoop in there and like scoop it out. That seemed gross to me. That cabinet that we looked at must have been it like over a hundred years old. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, but it wouldn't have worked for us because it was just too big. They, I believe they call that like a Hoosier. It's like a tiny, self-contained um, baking station. Like it has boards that you pull out of the thing to like roll out your pie crust or put, you know, mixer or, okay. yeah. It was really cool, but it was, it just wouldn't work with, yeah, it wouldn't work. Yeah. And then the one armoire that we did like, the top was peeling off, but it really, that one would have worked. That was what you call a shiffer robe. It well, was... It was chipped all right. <laughs> no, Shifero. Oh. <laughs> it has one door where you hang like, like... It's like a closet for a child. It has one side where you would hang clothing. And then on the other side, you open the door and it has like shelves. I have a question for you though. What's the question? Are you... Yes. Leaving the jam to see. <laughs> no. That's too bad. I'm not. <sighs> I'm sorry to hear that. But are we going to watch Drag Race while we eat? Absolutely. <laughs> what kind of a question eight, is that? Guys? We're on season, season eight and she already knows the winner. By accident. I didn't mean to. Okay. For real, it was an accident. But what'd you think of that hundredth episode? Uh, I love seeing all the winners together. That was so much fun. As much as they were starstruck, so was I. We were like, oh my god! Love it. It was awesome. All of our faves. Except Bianca wasn't there, but... Yeah, that really sucks. But I follow her on Instagram, and she is fabulous. Mm -hmm. I have to say. She's a real hag. She's a lot of fun. <laughs> this is your pizza. Did you notice the big changes? <laughs> We just reviewed them off camera. So guys, I don't know if you're ready for this or not, but it's very different. So get ready. Oh, what? What's the Berkey doing over there? I don't know, it's sitting on a pot. Yeah, it's sitting on a pot. It's like the Tin Man. And then I like it because I can see that print that Han Hanley gave us better. I really like that print. And it was kind of hidden behind the stuff that was over there. But here's the really big change. Oh my. This is way different. So we've got our nutcrackers over there, which I have to rearrange. They kind of got messed up in the move. <laughs> got our basket of snacks up there. Um, I guess the computers are staying there for now. Here is uh, the armoire. I'm thinking about painting it black, like this one. So it's gonna have the black on the bottom and then natural top. Maybe even do, you know, something. No, nah, you know what? I don't know. I don't wanna crap it up with like a stencil or something, but I think, um, I think it'll be nice. Maybe I'll even change out the hardware. I don't know. Um, yeah. But I feel, let's, let's take a step back. <laughs> I feel like it's um, less busy because we had those organizer things before with all the books and, you know, there was a lot going on. Now it's kind of a little bit more simple. And we added the lights over here to the um, display on the buffet, the, the buffet display. So, and we've also got uh, the house over here with um, <laughs> the island of misfit uh, people. 
so that's fun. And it's almost nine o'clock, so that means it's time for dinner. I realize it's that late. Yeah, it's late. You were so busy watching all your little YouTube friends. <laughs> time just flies when you're having fun with your YouTube friends. We're having broccoli too. Do you love broccoli? Remember the time Sean got up and had a whole plate of broccoli? Mm -hmm. The boy who would only eat hamburgers, uh, frozen fries. pizza, french fries, and uh, Captain Crunch peanut butter. Now he's eating whole bowls of broccoli. I know, it's quite a change. It is quite a change. And like straight up vegan food, like something that tastes like cardboard. Because I love cardboard. He'll eat cardboard. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, that pumpernickel bread, though, what'd you think about that? That's pretty good. It was really good. I'm still thinking about that. Still thinking about that pumpernickel. But that's a good brand. You like pumpernickel? Yes. You're lying. You don't even know what it is. You lie. <laughs> you lie. <laughs> Shawnee, what's better, pizza or broccoli? Pizza. Oh, okay. He hasn't totally lost his mind. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, it's the next day and boy, do I look at... <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop. You know what looks great? The dining room. Yeah, right? I like it. What do you think, sir? It's better, for sure. Yeah, this is it in the light of day. Loving it. Ring light. <laughs> Gotta love a ring light. Yes. All right, so the pups just ate. Yeah, here's a new pup. And I have a pug. <laughs> it's not new, it's been there for years. Sean, what's up? You open love you? What? Open up mail. Okay, we'll open it later, okay? Sean's been really enjoying his advent calendars. Chris and Maddie got, uh, Sean, this one advent calendar for his birthday, and he has been living for it. Oh, it's uh, oh, uh, what's the news flash? Vegan Beyond Meatballs launch at Costco. Wow, so this um, has a different book, a tiny little Disney story book for every day of the month, well, up until Christmas. So they got that, um, and he just loves it. The first day I had totally forgotten about it and he walks into the, uh, the living room and is holding up this book showing it to me and I'm like, where did you get that? Who did you take that from? <laughs> I forgot where it had come from and then I was like, oh, he went in there and got it. Oh. So Sean, what book did you get today? Let's see. He's been reading them out loud to us as well, so it's been really nice. All right, can you turn that down please, sir? Oh, today he got Olaf's Frozen Adventure, and it's a really nice book. Yeah, we God bless. You. We got that calendar at Aldi. Yeah, that was a good deal. So he's really been enjoying that. I'm glad he's been enjoying it. I know. Sean is a, uh, he doesn't need a lot to, uh, be happy. He just needs what he wants. Oh, I guess he doesn't <laughs> read a lot. I was like, yeah. No, he doesn't need a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, you know, he's got his specific things mm -hmm. that he likes, and that's it. That's all he needs. May the best woman win. <laughs> this egg definitely cooked up a lot different than the other one. Uh-huh. That's... Yeah. <laughs> Don't make that face. It's not what I'm used to. Just because you're not used to it doesn't mean it's... Yeah. She's not good at that. It cooks a lot thinner. She's not used to it. And it... Or has approved the sale of lab-grown chicken Yeah, I saw that. Sell meat, right? Is that what they're calling it? I think it's cellular meat or something like that. They grow it from a, a single cell. I feel like... It's going to be a no from me, dog. Mm. This one <laughs> might be better for like baking and stuff. Like yes. You're going to make a quiche, but I feel like it's not as good for like the... Um, well, maybe if I had the chance to cook it and show you guys what can be done with it, you'd change your mind. I'm not saying it's crap. I'm just saying... I like, know. I know. to the other one. I know. Anyway, <laughs> that's the end of another vlog. I'll take that from you, sir. Thank you. <laughs> I like how Sean just holds out his plate when he's done. You know what? We do the same thing to him.
when yeah, he's cruising like, by, we just hold out. Uh, yeah, we say, please take this to the kitchen. <sighs> We're so nice to each other. <laughs> anyway, that's it, kids. Today's another day, and we got plenty to do, believe me. Anytime. I'm swamped. <laughs> Thank you for watching. The dogs are very excited for today. <laughs> and until tomorrow, much love. <laughs>